Okay, my daughter Hillary is going to fly her new drone. And uh, she's already uh, played with it for a few minutes. And the video from that is excellent. This is, she's got, I don't know how many drones, you know, little tiny ones that are fit in the palm of your hand up to this one that she's got. And uh, this one is the best. It's got 4K video and has all the bells and whisker, whis whistles. And uh, I'm moving over closer to this air conditioning. <laughs> so the noise is going to be in some wet area here. We had a little tiny bit of rain. It's been above 100 degrees for I know the last week here as it has over much of the uh, United States. I wonder if I should have brought my tripod out. I don't even see how she can see with her uh, laptop with the sun on the screen. Is it her laptop that she's using? I think so. Guess I'll walk in like I'm zooming in here. Nope. I don't have much zoom with this camera, by the way. This is the Panasonic G7. I might have to get away from this air conditioner. It's too much. No, I'm sure that uh, I'm walking. I'm walking. I didn't know it was going to take her this long to uh, get it going. At least I'm on the sidewalk now. Whoops. I think we're going to have... Okay, I'm going to the eyepiece now. The Panasonic G7 has a terrific eyepiece. Okay, are we going to have liftoff? No, we're not going to have liftoff. By the way, that's me stumbling and staggering. I don't drink. Uh, I've had that problem. And my doctor just says it's old age. I mean, I don't think it is. I think there's something going on. Because I've, you know, I mean, this started, I don't know, six months or a year ago, has progressively gotten worse. I guess this should be getting a drone ready to fly video. Okay, I'm in the sun now. I can still see through the eyepiece, so the eyepiece is pretty fantastic on this. Is that the one that's up in the tree? Yeah. I got it down, I got a single ring today. I got one. This one was stuck in the tree for a few days, by the way. She got a pole ordered in from Amazon, got it out of, actually she got help from the maintenance guy here uh, in the apartment complex. He came over and said, let me help you with to get it down. And I, of course I was warning Hillary about 
you know, don't get anywhere near a power line with that. And then, you know, they got it down, you know, the maintenance guy got it down for them. Just before we came out here, I said, you know, you don't get that pole anywhere near power line. I said, it's not just touching it, and she didn't know that. I said, electricity, and she says, oh, that's why the pole said, stay 10 feet away, she said. So now I've told her, and I'm telling you, of course, you know, stay away from power lines. Don't be climbing up in trees near power lines. Don't be, you know, if you get something stuck in a tree near a power line, be careful. Okay. Not, not going, huh? Okay. Okay. This was being filmed with the Panasonic G7 camera, and I have it on the tripod this time, so it ought to be a little bit smoother. So this is attempt number two. Number one didn't work because the drone got wet. It was up in the tree for a few days, and we had high heat, no rain, and just the night though before she got it down, actually a maintenance man here at the apartment complex got it down for her. Uh, the, apparently the battery might have been, so this is attempt two. And this is maybe not going to be successful either. It may be a DR, but DR, dead right there. She thinks it's going to go. The GP, that's the reason she turned it around like that is uh, orientating with the GPS unit or something. And she has 13 or 14 GPS satellites, and she has a frown on her face, and I don't think it's going to work. Bummer. Bummer. I got a finger in front of the lens here. I've never used the tripod and the uh,
Okay. It's hot out here. I think it just needs to stay home and dry out. I think we have lift off. Uh, oh, it's way. Uh, I don't know where it is. Ooh. I'll never catch it on this. I can't even look up that high. It makes me dizzy. I'll fall over. idea where it is. But she's happy, so it's flying someplace. Well, she'll have video from it to use. I have to take this off the tripod. I have to try to track this thing.
if I put it in, if I try to go back any further, I'm gonna fall over. And I don't know where it is again. But it is flying. I guess I should look where she's looking, except I don't have the greatest. There it is. Okay, down. Now she should be getting video from it. Is it in the tree yet? <laughs> I don't know where it is, but they're looking up in the high sky. I think she's telling it to return home. Nope, I guess it's down here. Maybe the sky over here is looking up. Over there. this video to a conclusion because I can't even find the thing it's up so high okay a little bit of an update uh, the video you just saw now I think I'll put this at the beginning no, I'm gonna put it this at the end the video I just saw of uh, Hillary uh, flying her drone I have been waiting for a couple days for her to give me video from the drone so I could put it in here. But she's been busy working and she hasn't got it to me and I just want to go ahead and uh, put this video up. So that's what you've just uh, just seen. Uh, we'll make, I'm anxious to get because I saw the video on her <coughs> cell phone from the drone and uh, the video is really good. She didn't get good video of me, which was kind of hoping, but, uh, you know, that sounds bad, doesn't it? Egotistical or, I don't know, but anyway. But uh, she'll be making some more videos, so 
Thank you very much for watching this one. Sorry I couldn't include the video from her uh, drone, but it'll be coming one of these days.